Hi guys, it's um, a deja vu. It's, it's me. Hi guys, it's me, Adija Roshona. Welcome back for those who know me and watch my video, my first ever video. And for those who don't know me, hi. So today we are going to be doing um, a sneaker collection haul kind of video. Well, basically I have a collection of sneakers that I barely wear and um i just say well you know i don't have anything to do right now so let me just show the people what i got now mm -hmm. and it has some really funny comments on like videos that i posted on tiktok about my sneakers just to clear the air i have a small foot right i have small feet right I wear probably size three, three and a half, two and a half, depending on what kind of shoes, four sometimes, depending on what kind of shoes. Yeah, so some of the makes of my shoes are completely different to other sizes that people will be accustomed to buying. So when I post my videos on TikTok, or like if I post a picture, somebody will comment and say, like, you know, um, it had this one comment where this person was like, I hate to keep it a buck with you. Like they from Americana. They said, um, I gotta keep it a buck with you. That shoes is fake. So I'm like, me here watching my shoes, like, do I wear um bootleg? Do I really wear bootleg? Cause I want to know. So I'm gonna look up fake versus real shoes and look, my shoes is literally kid sizes. So it's gonna be completely different to other sizes, bigger sizes than mine. Even like my girlfriend's shoes, some of her shoes are um different to like bigger sizes than her own. So you see for all those comments, let me just get out of the way. I don't wear banky, I don't wear boots. So I'm gonna show you what I have. So today we're gonna be um reviewing. Well basically I just show you all the shoes and I will tell you like my experience wearing it and stuff like that. The first shoe that I ever purchased um very funny story i went to bagel oh this is the thing looking fresh still because i was gonna sell it well i am selling it for anybody who wants to purchase it it is a size 3y in preschoolers i think or grade school preschoolers oh. anyways it's a 3y so if you want the shoes you could comment no not comment because my comments off. so you can message me i have a business email link to the bottom or you can message me on instagram directly yeah i like these shoes thank you but i wear them like twice and i don't really want them anymore because i have enough shoes yeah. but anyways so i went to bagel to do i don't know if you know this artist but skeng i went to bagel to do skeng here and it was a real last minute thing i had to rush from the salon and go straight to the airport to meet them and stuff like that right so i did not have any clothes or anything i just picked up all my equipment you know it's a big gig get to go scan here so i forget to pick up clothes i never went home so i don't have no clothes i have an address in the airport with my equipment i bag with my equipment and no clothes upon when i reach everybody mind you i had to buy a last minute tickets so long wait for standby da, da, da. the whole works anyway so i reach over there so i have no shoes no clothes no nothing and uh, um they wanted to go like this party thing right it was some kind of party that we would get invited to like nearby where we were staying right and uh, i have no freaking clothes so i don't know how to go and spend monies and going to the town of Tobago, I don't even know no mall, no shop, no place, no nothing to buy these clothes. I didn't looking for things. Um, and I'm finding this walk through mall, and I went and buy a little Jordan and a little outfit. 
but you see how my shoes were like my size is very small the shoes actually came up to like a reasonable a reasonable price but i can't remember how much it was but it was a reasonable price um yeah so i was like hmm, my first shoe i had to buy into big maybe even know if the thing real or the thing fake so i did ask my mother because my mother is a sneakerhead tell me the shoes real make sure the shoes real you know because i'm not leaving to be able to come to that and get embarrassed for wearing no banky sorry so anyway she said yes it's real about so i end up buying it and i wear it to go out and sing you know when i come to that that shoes was the thing for me i like the shoes and to boot my girlfriend had like a matching shoes to mine um a blue and white and black i'm gonna show you right this is our own oh god it's dirty hmm she does wear bigger sizes to me but you know so i said it kind of matching so this will be our first matching shoes so we end up wearing the both of them to go redemption and that was a good party and i enjoy myself and i enjoy the wear of my shoes so anybody who wants to wear it and you know have good experiences good stories to tell in the shoes hit me up Anyways, next shoes, moving on. <laughs> we have the Jordans. Oh, yeah, forgive me. I do not know the names of these shoes. I just know the color and forgive me. I don't know big sneaker head. I don't know the name of these shoes. So I have to like jog my memory. Um, this is the Jordan 3 Retro. This one. I wear this. wear this this in the shoes oh they see how my shoes does never be looking dirty nothing you know don't make my door looking like it oh my god but yeah my shoes always spiffy well i can't say my shoes be looking dirty anyways i bought i got the shoes from nika glory yes sneaker glory on instagram i could link the instagram in the description for you all if you all want to buy shoes from them because basically the majority of my shoes came from sneaker glory so you're gonna hear me talking about them a lot they have really good quality shoes um you get your shoes on time especially when they now drop so like the shoes could drop today probably like three days after or like a week after depending on how it is um you will have your shoes trust me good customer service good delivery service everything so y'all could message them you know order your little shoes you know get with the times get with the times because i mean everybody wearing sneakers these days but yeah and mind you i was never no sneaker i had nothing but i'm still not a sneaker because i barely know the names of these shoes but you know what i mean i didn't have no big collection or nothing I basically had like one or two little shoes and sandals and slippers and things. But my mother, she realized sneakers, my girlfriend realized sneakers. So they got me into it now. So yeah, I like these shoes. I wore them for my mommy's birthday. She had a little birthday thing home and everybody wore the same shoes, you know. So it was a good wear, it was a good fit. I have pictures I could inst um i could insert pictures right here for you all of the outfit that i wore with these shoes it is the jordan 13s okay so this shoe now i think was my second shoes to my shoe collection yeah my second shoes i like the shoes to be honest, I probably wear the shoes. Hmm. I probably wear the shoes probably more than more than three times. To be very honest, I probably wear it more than three times. It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. Let me be real. It's cute. It's really cute. But as you all can see, that what I was talking about is that like um my shoes compared to other shoes will be but well, other sizes 
will be completely different. So when people see me wearing my shoes or they see me posting pictures on it or videos or whatever, just know it's not a bootleg. It's not a bootleg. You can research it, you can do your research. And that's why reading is key and looking up shit is key. Because smaller sizes have a completely different make. So my shoes now, this one, I think the difference with mine to other sizes is like this here is just a sticker. Oh god, I don't know if all oh, you can see it's a hmm, lot fatter. This thingy inside here is just a sticker and let me see if I get another another one to show you the difference. So mine is a sticker inside with like Jordan Man 23 on it. And this is a size 5. This is not a sticker. Oh gosh, I can't see. I don't know how to. <laughs> it is like a kind of reflector thingy in there where it's not a sticker. It like actually changes colors and the Jordan man is like hovering over the 23. And you know, it, it, it's, it's a nice flick. But that's the difference between my size and. Uh, a five and a, a five and any other bigger sizes you know in this one i have other shoes that i could show all you the difference right so if you guys are telling me how i wear bootleg shoes i feel real offended because i know how to spend my money and i know how to do my research you know before i buy shit so yeah so if i want to like another video where i show you the difference between my shoes and a bigger size you all could comment or oh, dm me <laughs> and i'll show you but yeah those are the three shoes that i selected for this video i have others so i will upload the others another time but i wanted to tell you a story about that last shoes um so we were going I remember the name of the concert. What I know is a concert. It was life. My battle. The life thing. Anyways, so yeah. And I'm buying the shoes from Trini Shorts, right? They have real good customer service as well. And delivery as well. So if you all want your shoes, you all know the two plugs. Trini Shorts, Sneaker Glory, and well, you know you can order your stuff online. But it's like the convenience of having a store in Trinidad. If you're located in Trinidad, you know the convenience of having a store delivered to your house, your work, wherever you are, wherever it's convenient for you. You know, you can message them. Um, you could also tell them I sent you, Adesha. Um, yeah, I don't know about any discount or anything. But you know, just say let me show them up because I I just really support these stores on Instagram, you know. And I want you all to also support them because they have very good quality when it comes to shoes and they know their thing, you know. Anyways, so we are going to the event and buy the shoes, didn't have no outfit typical didn't have no outfit so i had to now look for a last minute outfit i think i ended up getting it on instagram but i don't, I don't think they had delivery they stood out buying my outfit from i don't think they had delivery or anything so i had to like send somebody to go for it and sugar on us and i because i definitely wasn't driving at that time oh yes i was driving but i was scared to like drive from where i was living to so far and things so i only used to go, like you know close places and stuff but now i'm a, I'm a bad driver Boop. bad Anyways, driver so yeah send somebody to go and buy it and you're gonna da, 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 you know i don't even know when i send a person the outfit come up to 500 something dollars <laughs> i thought the outfit would have been like a 250 or you know you know that's how reasonable outfits will be to me i don't know 500 something dollars and then i buy that shoe 
Oh, look at imagine my bill just to go one concert. Shameful. Anyways, so yeah. When you can end up going to the concert now. Yeah. That concert was real weird. Because I don't listen to like Movado music and thing. For all the Movado lovers out there. Praises to you. But I don't listen to Movado music at all. So like I was very bored when he came on. I was real bored when he came on. I was just looking for food to eat and thing to drink and you know. That's why it's mostly go anywhere for thing to eat and thing to drink. But yeah. The only performance I had actually like was um Rondo thing Broadway touchdown totally. his performance was real nice um although I was like halfway into it it was real nice it was him and LR and then it also <laughs> had <laughs> was I from oh skank oh yeah I have videos of busting down <laughs> I have videos of busting down to some skins <laughs> you know so big up one you know to perform the, the food was nice as well i just went to man's sleep because i don't really like partying all that much so what i really look forward to is when i start to get sleepy because i know when i go home i go and sleep real good real freaking good but yeah that was my experience with that shoes um it had other times i wore it but i was just the first time that i wore that shoes if you want to see any more videos from me about shoes about hair oh yeah yeah yeah. my dora wig is from nis virgin something like that. just don't know nis virgin hair on instagram they are trimming that beast yeah if y'all want to see me do any other videos you can dm me on instagram email me if you want i don't know who else use emails but yeah, you can email me if you want. Thank you for watching. It was nice doing this little video. I hope I get to do more videos because I really want to be consistent with this YouTube thing. Um, yeah. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you.